In this video, I am going to show you how to add a rich text editor so that you can edit the detail page very well. Okay, so I just at first go to bootstrap and and go to pricing. This is an example of bootstrap template. I just copy this. Okay, so just right click and click on view page source. Just copy this header. So go to story list and and paste before the container. Okay, just change here story book and write a para and write a para. You can find here some short stories. Okay, so just go to the browser. Refresh it and run the local host. Okay, so you can see the header. It's look like better. Now go to the admin. Okay, now go to the story and go to the any story and in the body here I add the rich text editor. Django CKE editor is very easy to use. At first I will show you how to use Django CKE editor and then I will show you how to use tiny text editor. So at first go to Google and search for Django CKE editor. Okay, go to PYPI site and go to the latest version and just copy it pip install django cke editor open your cmd and just install the package okay so now go to settings.py here at first add the app cke editor check the spelling C K E D I T O R. Okay, so now save it and go to the models.py in the story application. Here, at first, import the rich text editor. So from C K E editor. So from C K E editor. Dot fields import rich text editor. Sorry, rich text field. So just change this field to rich text field. Okay, this is the body. So just type rich text field. Okay, now save it and run the server. Now open the browser and just run the localhost and go to the admin, go to the story and go to the any and click on any story so you can see now the rich text editor has been added here okay so you can edit this so i just copy this and here paste the title and normal this is heading two tag and you can change the color the styles italic so now you can use this rich text editor okay so now save it and run the localhost and go to the selfish giant you can see now here this is the html code of this let fix this so go to the story detail dot html here just type story dot body and save okay now save it run the server and go to the browser and refresh it okay so you can see now this is the title of the story and this is also be the title of the story i add in body so it is not needed here so it is very easy to use this cke editor in django just Go to the models and 
just import at first import the reach text field and change the model field to reach text field okay so just remove it reach text field from body and type models dot text field and remove this also and go save it and go to the settings dot py and remove the app cke editor and save it so now go to the story and go to the admin okay now here i use the decorator so type add rate admin dot register and enter the name of model at first the model is category and then type the class and the class name is category admin the admin a is capital and c is capital so inherit from so inherit from admin dot model admin okay now i add here list display and list display by name and slag go to models dot py here name and slag here are two fields so go to the admin and here type name and second is slag you can choose any of one so now save it and next type address admin dot register and register the model category. Sorry, register the model story. Now type the class. The class name is story admin. Inherit from admin dot model admin. Here I also want to add list display. and list display by title or publish so go to the models.py here title or publish are two fields so go to admin.py and just type here publish okay so now class media media class will join the javascript to this admin okay i will use later so now save it and run the local host go to browser and go to admin okay so now go to story so you can see here list display has been added so go to the categories so you can see here also the list display by name and slag so in the next video i will show you how to add the tiny text editor in the body field so click on so click on any story here i will add tiny text editor in the next video so thanks for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe